welcome to fruity blue in this video i will teach you how can you control your android phone from your pc there are tons of apps for this purpose but i have chosen five of them i will show you the complete method from start to finish uh, this method is useful for almost everyone uh, especially those people who do their uh, documentation or office work and those people who are developing android apps uh, but they don't want to uh, hold their mobile phone again and again uh, they can control their physical device from their pc uh, using these apps so our first app is streamweaver which is free uh, for personal use you have to install teamweaver host on your android phone and teamweaver app on your windows pc I have installed it on my PC. You can see here I have opened and logged in with my account. And also I have installed it on my Android phone. Here it is. And first of all, you need an account uh, to which all your devices can be associated. So if you don't have an account, sign up for one. I already have account, so I will log into my account. Once you tap the assign button, your device will be associated to your email account so you need to log into same account in your pc you can see here my device if i click on remote control it will connect to my device via internet so i will touch on start now and my screen is shared i can use my mobile phone from here it is very fast indeed you can see it is updating at the same time I will, I will try to show you you can see here it is very quick so here is dashboard where you can see your CPU usage your RAM usage and remaining battery and other some information here is remote control of your uh, mobile phone here are the apps which are installed on your mobile phone and some settings so i'm gonna close it so our next app you can see is airdrite i have opened it into my pc and also in my mobile it is same like team ever you need an account to connect your devices so please log into your account or if you don't have one I just sign up for one so I have opened it into my Android phone also you need to connect your cable uh, because they need it so connect to cable and click on non rooted setup once connected you can control it from your PC so you can see here it is also very fast So our next app is Mobizen. Uh, this is also a very old app. I have used it for many years. Like the other two, you also need an account here. So I have to log in into my account. So I have to open the Mobizen app into my Android phone. So log into your account and connect the cable. it's same like mobile phone you can take pictures record videos or write something on it
so there is power button also working here so our next app in this list is anydesk most of you will be familiar with this app uh, i have installed it on my pc and android phone i'll just open it and enter the address and connect it accept all the warnings displayed on your mobile phone and once accepted your screen will be shared you can control it from your pc it is the fastest app the earlier 3 so we are moving to the end this is our last app and its name is a power mirror uh, their website is a power soft dot us us and it has ton of features i am currently using it it can support maximum resolution of 2k and frame per second up to 90 and lot of other features and above all it does not require internet to connect your mobile phone to your pc so i'll show you how to do it i'm going to open the app on my mobile phone and also on my pc tap on mirror it will search for pcs or other devices you can see here my pc when i click it uh, it is it shows me some options mirror pc to phone or mirror phone to pc so i am going to mirror phone to my pc and then i click start now it will start sharing and it is currently using my wifi and it is my home router you can see there is no cable connected and you can show all the updates on my pc uh, but you can not control it from pc because uh, controlling from pc needs a cable connection and usb debugging enabled so i am disconnecting it from here now i am going to show you how to connect it with cable and control uh, it from pc on opening app click on usb and it will search all the devices on mobile phone allow all the warnings but you can see uh, you can use all the tools here you can go to full screen or you can take screenshot or take video recording of your mobile phone screen you can use to mark it anything here this is useful uh, when you are presenting something that's it for today these are the five apps we wanted to tell you i hope you found it very helpful see you in the next video with some other useful stuff useful and cool stuff keep watching and make sure to like and subscribe okay goodbye